Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Oh, there it is, right in front of you. Or you what? just walk past it. Look at the floor. Uh -huh. Look in front of you. There you go, right there. Shoot it out. And let's go find us some evidence. Bro, drop down the fucking hole. I think it's RT and B at the same time. I have no clue. Dance, dance. I'm falling. <laughs> I'm, I'm pressing all the fucking buttons, but I don't get it. Maybe it's a leap of faith in it. It's like RT and X. I could be wrong. I've tried both. It, it doesn't seem to be working. Why does the game hate me? Huh, maybe crouch. And just kind of like walk. Maybe just kind of stay on the edge and just hold out, keep holding B. Nope. That no, was. None of these work. <laughs> how does I? Even... How do you get down there? Apparently, you don't. <laughs> God, this mission is a nightmare. I would say this is bad design on the game. You're telling me, bro. You're telling me. <laughs> I'm I've, well, I don't I've know. literally hit every fucking button on the controller. Well, there's gotta be some kind of right permutation to it. <sighs> okay, this is getting annoying. Um uh It says try crouching and then going forward slowly. Clever. <laughs> Let's see what secret you keep that is around. so specific. I that is what I've been doing the entire time. And now loot chest. This might be something. And our poor bat to Sigurd. Let's get out of here. Just, just fucking go up. Alright. <laughs> now, if we could, we'd burn this whole mission to the ground. I'll burn the whole fucking village down, though. Well, see, what killed me, it's bad design that the raven can't point. That's like the one mission where the raven didn't point out anything. And the fact that the climb mechanic is so, like. Bad. It's, it's, I was gonna say, it's so specific. You Don't have to hold bad. down crouch while moving slowly. Oh, it's definitely bad. The poor bad Sigurd and the brothers. Yo, why was there leather from Ivar? That's what I would say first and foremost. Ivar has seen explaining. He does. I think it's gonna end with your axe buried right between his head. That doesn't sound right. Too bad to me. He's bloodthirsty. I was I do like the setting of this game. The atmosphere is very nice. I like like the fall and like foresty areas very much. Eivor, tell us you learned something. Letterchester and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Letterchester is a large village, and Templebroth, it's an old military fort. Not much else. Burkrate could be at either one. We should check both as soon as possible. And what do we do with Tona? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Borgred now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Dringir. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me led the Chester then, all by my fucking lonesome. Bring a friend, brother. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon. And I think next is the final mission, and then you get this area on your team. Finally! <laughs> Bartering! Yes, finally, mission complete. It's the worst mission I think we played in any game we ever played.
He's gonna go steal a horse. See, you see if it's in the map. Oh yeah, get a new helmet. There you go. I think you can go to the map and find the next quest. Probably. Uh, is that it? The oh, let's see, see what's in quest. Uh, the walls of Tempera, whatever. That's the one, right? Yes, I think so. Yeah, part of the Kingsman saga. Well, let's do it. Alrighty. Let's go speak to Sigurd. Oh, you are 2,000 away. Uh, Is there any way you fast, fast travel there? Yeah, probably. I'm so tired for no reason all of a sudden. <laughs> well, because you played the most boring mission known to mankind. Yeah, that's fair. I think you go to world. World day. No, it's up the. Oh, no, you see that harbor? Hunt, you just. Seth. What? Huh? You fast traveled for. You hit. You. <laughs> what? Huh? Hmm? Did you get any sleep last night, buddy? I worked. <laughs> that makes so much sense. Yeah, stick with me, but you basically fast travel to the furthest possible point Damn away it. from. But there is one that you can fast travel to that makes it a lot easier. If you look up to it, there's a harbor you can uh, fast travel to. Okay. People give Seth a break on that one. Whenever something happens. Well, it's just this game is huge. It's too huge. So you see it up there? Now to the left, there's that yeah. anchor. There you, there you go. Makes a lot more Ooh. sense. Hey, Abor needs his legs to be worked out. He had to go back to Raventhorpe. Make sure it didn't get invaded and or set on fire. That's an important part of the job that people don't realize. No, a lot my of part of is on fire. Well, like for a house, that's like rule like one. You, the only thing you really don't want is it to get robbed or on fire. True, true. Like if it floods like lightly, you can patch it up. I mean, technically, there's a fire. If it's contained, you can always repair it. But you never want to engulf in the flames. But maybe you do. So how far away are you now from the point? Uh, 1,100 meters. <laughs> Get in the boat. That's actually probably we sail the fastest, for... I, fastest way. <laughs> yeah. Let's get out of here. <laughs> and we make a hard right. Come on, man. Work. Yeah. Row! Row! I think you just gotta follow, like, the main river. It's not a lot of twisty turns. Something like that, yeah. yeah it should be good. Ooh, we got some loop music playing. So what you got going on today, Seth? For people who don't know, this is our last episode recording of the day. I mean, it does sound like you need it. Oh yeah. Wait, how did um, how did uh, how did tires go? You had a bit of a snafu with tires. Uh, it was interesting. So, <laughs> yeah. The first day I went, my tires were supposed to be there by like one o'clock that day. They were like, you can just sit around if you want, or you can go do whatever. And I was like, I'll just fucking sit here and chill out until then. So that's what I did. Right. Half ass slept off and on for a little bit, and then, uh, ow. like one one o'clock rolled around, and I was like, "Hey, what's going on?" And they were like, well, "We're so sorry, we uh, you can't figure out what's going on with your tires. The guy who's supposed to be delivering them is like not answering our calls, Here. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we have no clue. So 
they were like, it's up to you, but you can go home or like whatever. And I was like, yeah, I'm just going to go home and go to sleep. So that's what I did. Yeah, you know, like, you know what? Screw this day. I went back yesterday and they were like, okay, glad you went home because your tires are going to trip to like four. I was like, okay, that's great. So I, uh, wow, got my tires, you know, like an hour and a half process. It wasn't, it was just slow. Where did, uh, you don't get specific in where's in case someone wants to do a vendetta on your behalf. But, um, but did you go to, like, a big, like, chain tire store, or did you go to, like, a, like, a local one? I don't know how to word that. Uh, I mean, I guess it would be considered big. I don't really know. Gotcha. Well, I had tires, like, a month ago. Uh, and it took, like, half an hour, if that. Han, zoom in ever so slightly. See, there's like a right turn. Oh, yeah, keep going. Yeah, just keep going. Kind of See how the river naturally. Just keep going straight. If I had tires a month ago, I said, I, they're like, yeah, you should probably leave. And then I drove away, and they're like, hey, come back. I was like, and the person who took me, I was like, hey, can you come back? No, it wasn't, it wasn't like a bad process, it just it sucked because I went one day and then didn't get tired and I had to come up, go back the next day. I do it. That's why I used to hate like all that dentist stuff I had. It's like, alright, we can work on one tooth a day, basically. Yeah, right. So, I mean, you have, and you have like four teeth, so let's, let's do, just do them right in a row. I'm like, I absolutely hated this. With every fiber of my being. Sort of like speaking with Sigurd, he was just like, maybe we should just kill the king. Can make this whole process a lot more easier. Oh yeah, hundred percent. A, a, a lot less uh, tooth and nail. Oh, that was a real like game study. That it, when players were given like choices in games about between good and bad, people often made bad decisions when they were super bored or annoyed because they knew the bad decision was the quickest way out. <laughs> well, to battle. <laughs> to battle. So you're just gonna. <laughs> you guys have fun. <laughs> oh, please don't tell me it's not gonna let you because you're in a raid. Okay, good. Hey. What's with the prisoners? Man from the fortress, out on patrol. We squeeze them. Burger's not here. It's his queen they're guarding. Others with. Oh, you mean the ones you guys are raiding right now? It won't be long before someone comes looking for these men. We need to get inside and find Alan's will. Capture a queen to find a king. It might work. Only one way to find out. See if you can get anything more out of them. Me and Aber will take care of fetching Alan's with. Oh, then guide you. The Saxons won't welcome us through the front door. Is that, is that all? I'll no, I'll just go over there and find the, the leg, I guess. Okay. Yeah. Huh. And I think your guys are currently just running in and raiding. Finding, confront, lady. Something worth. Aethel worth. I did not hear how they pronounced her name. chasing some weasel across a new land, so be it. I am right where I wish to be. As am I. All right, now I think you... Yeah, Raven, now you can use it. To help track her so you're not just scouring the whole base again. Threat your wings. All right, so sh she is in there. Okay. Hmm. Oh, look on Han. Use uh, left trigger quickly. Mm -hmm. Now go left. Ooh, go left. And down. Han, keep going left. I think you can see your guys fighting on the streets. Oh, yep. <laughs> Weird. Well, hopefully they don't accidentally kill the queen. That'd be less than fun. 
It'll be fine. We'll do this the Viking way then. God damn it. Your fault. You guys are bloodthirsty. Oh, <laughs> uh, your highness. <laughs> like you're like blood dripping from your forehead. Ooh, nice dodge. Hey, hey, how long are you supposed to be moving like that? That's not cool. <laughs> the, yeah, the thing is, you stand still, I get the chop chop. <laughs> is he running away now? Oh, he's throwing rocks. So you can deal with him. This guy's kicking your butt. I think he dodges heavy attacks. I think that's this, like, character's thing. Just start doing light attacks, dude. Or Sigurd's got him. Oh my gosh, this dude's incredible. Bro, all he does is dodge at this point. Come on, use a... Yeah, the unknown NPC got the kill. Yeah, right. Go figure. Um, what's the uh, what's in the chest, Deadhead? <laughs> you alright? <laughs> yeah. There you Walk up. Ooh. So carboning it, you can upgrade like armor and stuff. Carbon. <laughs> Wealth tanking? What is that even? Oh, oh, look, there's someone you can talk to. So, yeah, there's like a little like exclamation point on the bottom. Oh, wait, that was inside the building, wasn't it? No, it's not. You're fine. Is it not? Seth, no. No, okay. no. <laughs> See? It's Sorry. down there. It's at the foot of the mountain. Ooh. Ow. Hey, powerful knees. Is that the queen? Well, no, I can revive someone, I guess. That's not what I was expecting. Oh, that, that's good. Saved your boy. He was horn swaddled. He was. <laughs> oh, you're very welcome. Oh, I think I think I know where you need to go. <laughs> now back up the entire building. Ow. Oh my That's gosh. Not even cool. Ooh, nice catch. You may have to just kill these fools. <laughs> That's. Just throw somebody. That's your buddy. Yeah, yeah. Oh, arrow to the back. That's always a good one. Bro, just go. The camera keeps pulling you towards it, doesn't it? I have no clue. It's not letting me go up there, though. I know that much. On, oh, use eagle. Ooh. Thanks, Sigurd. Oh, is that an entrance right there to your right? Right here? Oh, right there. See how there's a bunch of guards there? They're probably guarding her. Ooh, haha! -ha. Ooh, dodge! Oh come on, game, really? God, I, I... To be fair, you did come in here with like half, not even half health. Like, oh huh, maybe you can start picking them off. Oh, there you go. Yeah, <laughs> let them funnel in. basically black for you as well. I was going to say that. I was like, how can you even see right now? I, it's called I don't. 
Well, I mean, I, it looks like it's working. Let's. Come on, buddy. Come up here. That's literally not correct. You can use right trigger to target specific people. Okay. Just jump back jump over. You're like, if I die, I die. That's Sigurd right there. Oh yeah, you're right, it is. Hon, use Eagle Vision. I have an idea. Use Eagle Vision. It may... Yeah, there you go. Now you can see in the dark if you just kind of, like, spam it ever so often. Ooh, fight the Book of Knowledge. New ability, Piercing Shot. Oh, I think Sigurd got the rest of them. Hey, look who it is. It's someone. You three? Her fair lady. Lady I see <laughs> Scurry does not mean go to the other end of the room. Lost. Must always be found. Let my handmaidens walk free of this place. They have nothing to do with our quarrel. You hear that, Aver? Noble. Selfless. This is the sword you must strike a bargain with. A woman of quality. We seek only your king, lady. Tell us where Burgred hides, and we will leave without an ounce of blood spilled. Please, I... I don't... I don't know. Sure you Effective, do. Effective, She is only naive to her present danger. But she will soon understand. Wait. Those are the hands of one who washes linens. A servant. She is a decoy. Poor you genius. Watch the handmaidens. I'll follow Athel's way. I go to the right. Cam hands the camera right. Wow. <laughs> and just ignore all these fools and get to rolling. Ooh. Oh, I'm clicking the left stick. Isn't that how you sprint? Yeah. <laughs> now we're catching her. I wish we could send our raven and just go pluck out her eye. That would be pretty lit. I mean, she would definitely slow down. I would 100% do that, though. Oh crap, he's on a boat. <laughs> Getting the rabble boat. She's gonna die. Are you serious? Yes, apparently. You're supposed to ch You're supposed to chase her in the Okay, I'm gonna slide in the okay? Nah. Dude, you're just tired. That too. Dude, I wonder if... I wonder if, like... You could have just killed the... What's-his-face? Like, her driver. That's a very good point. I didn't even think about. Bro, just... Just stop. I'm trying to turn. <laughs> I, I was just turning with you doing nothing. She's still running. I'll give my girl some credits. She's trying. Help. Help me. I think you're gonna have. She's. You're gonna have to kill those guys. You think we care what your husband thinks? Uh, 
Okay, that's like an elite guard. Alright, if it restarts you back to the beginning, hurry and see if you can, like, as she's, like, sailing away, see if with your bow and arrow you can take out the driver. I definitely will, if possible. That way you avoid an encounter. And encounter. That's hard to say. Oh no, it's gonna spawn you right back to camp. Oh, okay. At least, I'm use your bow and arrows right now, pick him off. Ooh, his legs are his weak spots. Oh, and if you step away from him, your bow and arrow, if you use it on his legs, it's if you see it glow, it's his weak spot. Which means he'll stop dodging. <laughs> or not. <laughs> with me here. Now with me here. Come on, so close. Come on, bro, die. He's always gonna counter. Yeah, I noticed. That's what did. I think one of the other guys may have shot him. I have no clue. Oh, I did not think she would keep on running. Neither did I. You were easy. She cowered in fear the first time. Please tell me you get to kill this woman at the end of this, because she's really putting up too much of a hassle. Stay away from me. All right. Oh, don't kill her. It's like just talk to her. Stop what you are doing at once. Stop what you are doing at once. Don't you dare put your hands on me. Too late. A little, Quite close, hey, a little late for that. You are certainly making us work for it. Keep your hands off me, pagan. Have you lost your sense of hospitality? I regret asking. <laughs> Let me I like go. Avor. I demand it. Surely you could hop a fence, room. right? I would have Yay. To be mad. Do you understand what you're doing, pagan? I am the Lady of Mercia. Oh, I did not know that you were. I'm so sorry. You're wasting your oh. time. I won't talk. Not to you. Not to. I don't think. Oh, she's dead. She's so dead. <laughs> oh wait, is she? Wait. I won't talk. Not to you. Not to any of you barbarians. No, I think she broke free because she hit the water. Who knows how many more might die at the hands of us barbarians? You don't frighten me. Then you are a fool. I'm gonna have to nudge her to shore. And then call for your ship. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm gonna have to do. What, what the fuck is this lady doing? I say let her, just go in the way you want her to. Maybe too much push it. Yeah, too much pushing sends her away. So just let her hit shore right there. Just Han, go up to her. She's just laying there. Do you have to be picked up? I'm just gonna slowly put your face in the water for this really long time. Oh, she swam literally right to camp. Come on, don't. Seth, you're right there. That's <laughs> okay, we'll end the episode after this whole cutscene thing plays out. Alrighty. We'll cut a little bit early. Lady Others with. You have seen better days. 
God will sear your soul, heathen, if he can find it. Ooh, Why roasted. Catch, Sees as much a poet as you. Where's my Kathleen? What have you done with her? Your handmaiden, you mean? The brave one, dressed in royal finery? Season change with the others. I'll take them back to Tamworth. Get them talking. If she has so much as a scratch on her. I will inform Cheerwalk. He might have some ideas on how to get through to her. I will go to Lederchester. Eva may have had better luck. Sigurd, what about these prisoners? We've got what we need. Let them go. You're gonna kill them, aren't you? No, I'll let them, I'll let them free. Ah, I'll I cannot thank you enough. Right. Woohoo! So, next time on Two Aids in a Game. We got the Queen, man. Now all we need is the King. Yes, sir. As always, he's been Seth. He's been Josh. Bye bye.